my two were, you did. In life, I was your partner. Jacob Marley. Oh. What do you want with me? Can you sit down? I can. Well, do it then. You don't believe in me. <laughs> I don't. Why do you doubt your senses? Because a little thing affects them. A slight disorder of the stomach makes them cheat. You, you might be an undigested bit of beef. <laughs> a piece of cheese. A fragment of an underdone potato. There's more of gravy than of grave in you. Whatever you are. Do you see that toothpick? I do. Not looking at it. But I see it notwithstanding. Oh. Well then, I've, I've just got to swallow this and I'd be tortured for the rest of my life by a legion of hobgoblins. <laughs> all of my own creation. It's all humbug, I tell you. <laughs> Man of the worldly mind, do you believe in me or not? I do, I do, I do, I do. I must. But why do you walk the earth? And why do you come to me? It is required of every man that the spirit within him should walk abroad among his fellow men. If it goes not forth in life, it is condemned to do so after death. It is doomed to wander through the world. <laughs> cannot share, but might have shared on earth and turn to happiness. Why are you fed out? I wear the chain I forged in life. I made it link by link and yard by yard. I girded it on of my own free will and of my own free will. I wore it. You have my sympathy. Ah. You do not know the weight and length of strong chain you bear yourself. It was full as heavy and as long as this, seven Christmas Eves ago, and you have labored on it since her. It is a ponderous chain. Mark me! In life, my spirit never roved beyond the limits of our money-changing home. Now I am doomed to wander without rest or peace. Incessant torture, remorse. <laughs> but it was only that you were a good man of business, Jacob. Business! Mankind was my business. Their common welfare was my business. And it is at this time of the rolling year I suffer most. Hear me. My time is nearly gone. I come tonight to warn you that you have yet a chance and hope of escaping my fate. A chance and hope of my procuring Ebenezer. Thank you, Jacob. You were always a good friend of mine. You will be visited by three spirits. What? Was that the chance of hope that you mentioned, Jacob? It was. Oh, well, in that case, never mind. I think I'd rather not. Without their visits, you cannot hope to shun the path I tread. Expect the first when the bell tolls one. Look to see me. <laughs> 